عند روتيت ذكر ايضا لماذا الماتريكس تهاجم الذكوره والرجوله What is wrong with a masculine man? Well, I can tell you why they think there's something wrong with the masculine man, but that's because we're the gatekeepers of morality. We are, we are men are always going to be the ones that lead revolutions. When you're in charge of a country or you're in charge of a populace whatever it is. It's like the olden days, you walk into the new town and kill all the young men or the military age males. Slit all the boys throats because they're going to be a problem in five years. That's what it is. So if you let's imagine, let me make up a fake scenario. Let me just invent something. Let's imagine you want to lock everyone in their houses because of the common cold. Let's imagine you're completely tyrannical and you're a psycho. What you'd want to do is make sure that men comply. It's only the men who can stop the compliance. There's only enough men in one place saying fuck you. It's not women. If all the women get in a place, it's annoying. But if all the men get in a place, it's a revolution. It's different. It's the, it's it's large groups of men that are always going to be the backbone and fighting force and the number one thing they're afraid of. By reducing masculinity as a whole, you're reducing the warriors of society. They don't want people to stand up and say no, we stand for these values and we will not let you corrupt our children this way. So they have to try and attack masculinity at its core. Get you to the point where you're like, well, maybe it's good if I'm tolerant and they let and they poison everybody. That's what they want.